Dennis Mayer and Julia Forehand talking about the Signature Chefs Auction. And it's going on November 8th at 6 p.m. at the Hilton Garden Inn. And uh, you guys are going to be doing a uh, silent and live auction and a food tasting with multiple chefs. Yes, ma'am. Tell us kind of what the breakdown is, what's going to be going on. We're going to have several of our chefs here from Southwest Georgia. We've got several of our restaurants that will be bringing some of their tasty goods with mm -hmm. us. We've got Red Lobster and we're going to have Logan's uh, Cafe 230, just some of the ins and outs and eateries around um, here in Albany locally. We do have one coming from America's and then we've got our reigning defending People's Choice Champion here, Mr. Dennis Mayer. Uh -huh. He's going to be one of our main um, chefs yeah, here. Boy. We've got a couple of our um, Sponsors, Adtran is um, one of our major sponsors, and then Miller is um, one of our local beverage sponsors. So, so many different yes, things going on. Yes, so, talking about being the defending champ chef that's going to be there, what are, uh, can you share some of the things you're going to be making? Well, yes and no. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Don't want to give away your secret. No. What we want to, to make very clear is that if you, please come to this thing. It's for the March of Dime. Mm -hmm. You're going to get food that normally you can't buy here, I promise you. Mm -hmm. So, come see us. We're going to have we're going to have some sliders. We're going to have some really different stuff that you don't normally get in any restaurant, and that's the whole point of me doing what I do. Um, it's going to be great. It's going to be an incredible experience. You're going to have more food than you've ever seen in any one place Sounds in your like life. It. You know? like it. Yeah, it's great. Uh, the tickets are reasonable. It's for a great cause. They're mostly sold out, from what I understand. Uh -oh. um, it's a very popular event. Sure. So um, there's going to be a lot of folks looking at me, and <laughs> I, I have to be very good. I bet so. Yeah, I got to be better than I was last year. So uh, we're ready, and uh, it's going to be it's going to be a really incredible evening. Um, there's going to be tons of stuff to buy. Uh, come and buy it, please. <laughs> Um, I can tell you one thing, you asked okay. what we're going to have. I have a 10-pound suckling pig. There are no more. The farmers are not killing young pigs anymore. They're feeding them out because they want, the, the, they want them to be big and they want the money. Mm -hmm. Okay? We have a display piece. It's a 10-pound suckling pig. It's gorgeous. And we're going to auction that off for free at the end of the uh, awesome. night. Didn't tell you about no, that. No, you didn't okay. tell me about that. I got some more questions about that little piggy in a second. We're going to be back with them in just a little bit. If you guys want more information, you can call 432-1201. We're going to hand it over to Chris before we head back to talk with them. Chris. Dennis Mayer and Julia Forehand talking about the Signature Chef's Auction. It's going on uh, November 8th at 6 at the Hilton Garden Inn, and there's going to be a ton of food, more than you've ever seen, with stuff that you don't normally see here in southwest Georgia. We were talking about a suckling pig, and I wanted to know what the difference is between a suckling pig and a normal pig, a big pig. Generally, a suckling pig can go from zero to about 40 pounds. Okay, so it's just tiny. And, and that's tiny. And uh, beyond that, it's a regular, it's a regular animal. Okay, still okay. makes bacon. Uh, they're more decorative than they are uh, for, for eating. Ah, okay. Uh, there's not a lot of meat on them. They're beautiful. I can get them. We're probably the only ones who can, you know. Ah. So the food that we're going to serve is stuff that you cannot buy here because we're caterers and everything we do is custom made. Right. So okay. it's going to be a lot of fun. It sounds like it. And now fun. I want to hear more about it goes to the March of Dimes. Yes, ma'am. And it stays right here in our area. Yes, ma'am. Tell us about that. Well, we um, all of the money that's raised here from our silent auction, which we've got about 150 uh, different items on our silent auction. And then we're also going to have a live auction. And one of our major um, items on that is our Disney trip for four. Uh -huh. um, and that one really goes well. So we have a really uh, a lot of good bids on that one, but it just funds a lot of research um, to keep those premature babies um, from being born so early, and that's just one of our major um, items that we we look at. And you said you have almost 150 items? silent, yes, ma'am, for our silent auction. So you'll be able to get some of everything. We have some paintings, we have some beautiful pieces of furniture, just different types of items, some um, 
autographed um, pictures, just different different things. And then again, they're there for the delicious food. We do have um, several places, like I had mentioned earlier, from here around town. We've got um, out back. Um, we do have the Mr. Tim Underwood who will be there serving, and we know he's going to do some shrimp and grits yeah. um, and a fondue, so that's going to be really good. And then when you do come, like we said, Mr. Mayor is our reigning pe people's choice, so you'll be able to do the same thing this year, is okay. to go around and taste all the different food and then okay. to vote. Um, we've got less than um, 25 tickets wow. left, so we are doing really good, but we do need more people to come on down, and as you stated, the tickets are $50 a piece, okay. so please come on down. You'll have great, great, great fun. All right, if you guys would like more information, 432-1201. We appreciate you guys coming Thank on. I hope so it's much. a great success. Thank you. Thank you. All right, over to you, Chris.